I'm doing a series about our main UX slogans. The first and maybe most important is you are not the user, where you means anybody who works on a design team. Before I explain the slogan, let me talk a bit about the background. Most of our UX slogans have been around for decades. Sometimes the wording changes a bit because we always rewrite to be more concise. In fact, Brevity's Brilliance is another NNG slogan, which I'll explain in a different video. The main point of these UX slogans remains the same, decade after decade, because they describe fundamental facts of the design process and about the way humans use computers. In 1993, I wrote this book, Usability Engineering, about the methods to improve user interfaces. You can see the cover showing the usability engineer is in the process of building a bridge between computer capabilities on the left bank and user needs on the right bank of this river called interface complexity. Well, almost 30 years later, this is still a good way to visualize our job. Chapter one of the book, this is a bunch of slogans, including users are not designers and designers are not users. Now we have simplified these two slogans into the single equation, you are not the user. But the point is certainly the same. And my original slogans from 1993 do explain the underlying issues quite well. First, users are not designers, which means you cannot get a great design by asking users what they want. They don't know, and that's fine because it's not their job to be able to envision what technology can do if made better. We must observe users perform their actual job and do real tasks with the user interfaces we are trying to improve. It's our job as the UX professionals to deduce from these studies what should be done. Second, designers are not users. Unless, of course, you're developing a design tool. But even then, the designers on the team know much more than the outside designers who will be the customers. In general, anybody on a design team knows too much about their own product. And they probably also have higher intelligence than the average user. This means that anybody on a design team cannot judge whether something will be easy or difficult for the real users. If you're looking to find something on a website and you place it yourself in the location you think is the proper spot in the information architecture, then of course you'll go straight to the correct menu item when you want it. Easy. Uh, yes, easy for you. But all experience shows that many of the real users will try another menu item first and be lost in the wrong part of the IA for minutes, which will often cause them to abandon the site. That's another reason we need to do observational user testing with the target audience to see what's actually easy because we can adjust this based on our personal opinion. Just remember, you are not the user.